Taking material and changing it to a chart in sheets is very easy. Make sure you have good labels in the appropriate places so that your uh, it will automatically label that for you. When you create your chart, just select the area that you want to uh, have uh, included. Make sure you do not necessarily select all the data, but the resulting data, and then you can change it into a chart. The insert button and choose chart and it will let you see the chart types at that point. You can choose what ch type chart you want it would show up your particular data best and I'm just going to leave it on this one. But it automatically comes up. It talks about dogs and cats. It labels which color is dog and cat. Uh, it shows you the dogs and cats that the teachers have and the dogs and cats that the students have and it just labels this as pet armors for that thing, for the entire chart. And so we're going to insert that, and so we have it here. Notice when I, it's highlighted, you have this little downward arrow here, and that allows you to do other things with the, other than put it where it is. You obviously can slide it around on your screen wherever you want to position it. You want to kind of make sure that you have it all on one page if you want your data and your chart both to print. Or if you're doing something else with it, you're exporting it, you've got some off options here. And one of the nice ones is that you can save the actual chart as an image. And so that's when it's going to be good to include it in other things. It's going to automatically download it. And you'll find that then in your downloads folder. Um, so since it's saved.